remember very clearly when Sierra and Eli first met. And in those first few weeks, she was always messaging me, calling me, talking about this guy that would come into Caroline Cafe all the time. One time I was at Eli's house and we were out back grilling something and I asked him what he does for what he does for meals and stuff. He was like, oh, I just, there's a restaurant close by, I go over. Oh, okay. So how often do you eat there? Oh, once or twice a day. I'm not sure when it when it came out that there's a girl that works there that's kind of a cool waitress and he kind of favors that side of the restaurant. <laughs> Anyway, they got texting somehow, and something that was funny to me was he was going to go talk to her dad, <laughs> and uh, he was going to go meet him at a baseball game, <laughs> and he showed up, and he was on the opposite team. <laughs> <laughs> I remember he, he was talking to me about, I mean, how am I supposed to talk to him, and he's on the opposite, but anyway, he got it figured out then. Wish you guys both the best. Uh, looking forward to uh, what the Lord has for you as well. see Eli in a bad mood or very rarely but sometimes you know one point he'd start showing up and he was in a whole lot better mood and then when we all put it together that he had a crush on some girl you should have seen how his face got red it was it was spectacular he was so blushing and grinning the biggest grin you've ever seen I feel so good about you the choice you've made you too and I think it'll be a great life and you're stepping into the unknown so just embrace it and love God read the Bible and and do your best. I'm so glad for you. God bless you all.